Hello and welcome to Secure Den Password Vault for Enterprises. Secure Den Password Vault is a web-based self-hosted password manager which lets you centrally store, organize, share, manage, and keep track of all passwords, keys, documents, and other identities. It helps you establish a centralized password management system, control who can access what, audit all activity, and automate password security best practices. The product is offered as a binary package which can be centrally installed on a physical or virtual server within your premises or on private cloud platforms such as AWS or Azure clusters. It comes with everything needed and you don't require any other software or hardware. Installation typically only takes a few minutes. While the product has to be installed only on a central server, all your users can access the web interface using any standard web browser. That means users need not have to install anything on their desktops. SecureDen comes with a PostGre SQL database, and you have the option to use MS SQL Server as the backend database. All sensitive data are encrypted using AES-256 and stored on the database. Let me now provide a very quick demo of the product. The first step to getting started is to onboard your users and grant them access to the web interface. If you're using Active Directory or Azure AD in your environment, you can integrate it with SecureDen and import users. When you do so, your users will be able to log in using their Active Directory credentials itself. There's also a provision to keep the users in SecureDen in synchronization with the Active Directory. When you add or delete users in AD, the same gets reflected here. The other option is to create user accounts manually. In this case, the respective users will get a login name and a password to access the product. You can also integrate with any SAML-based single sign-on solutions like Okta, G Suite, Microsoft ADFS, One Login, Ping Identity, Azure AD, SSO, and others. SecureDen enforces role-based access controls with predefined and custom user roles. There are five predefined roles. Super Administrator, Administrator, Account Manager, Auditor, and End User. The Super Administrator is for break glass emergency access scenarios. The Super Administrator will be able to see all the passwords stored in the application. For example, if there are 100 users in your organization and each one is storing 10 passwords, the Super Administrator will be able to see all the 1,000 passwords. All other roles, including administrators, come under the purview of access controls. They'll be able to see only the passwords added by them and the ones shared to them. Typically, when someone adds a password to SecureDen, that user becomes the owner of that password. The password will be visible only to the owner. If the owner wants others to view the password, it has to be shared. When you log in, you will only see the passwords owned by you and the ones shared with you. Administrators have the privileges to manage the application and do user provisioning. Account Manager is similar to the Administrator but without user management privileges. Auditor will be able to view the reports generated in the system. End User can simply see the passwords allotted to them. Optionally, you can allow them to add passwords. In addition to the default roles, you can customize the permissions and create custom roles too. You can create user groups reflecting the team structure in your organization. For additional security, you can enforce multi-factor authentication for your users. SecureDen works with a wide range of multi-factor authentication systems such as Duo, YubiKey, any RADIUS-based authentication mechanism, or any TOTP authenticator like Google Authenticator, Microsoft Authenticator, and others. You can choose the one that best suits your requirements. Now let me get into password management. We use the terms accounts and folders in the context of password management. Any login credential that you store becomes an account. A group of accounts is called a folder. The first step with password management starts with consolidating and storing all of your passwords in the centralized vault. Accounts can be onboarded to secure Den's inventory in different ways. If you're keeping your passwords in an Excel sheet or a text file, you can import them in a few clicks. The easiest way to onboard the accounts of IT assets is to do a discovery. 
SecureDen comes with a powerful discovery engine that automates the discovery of computers, databases, and devices. If you're already using a password management software, you can export your data and import them. If you're using KeePass, you can import your data directly from KeePass. The other option is to manually add all accounts. You can classify the account being added as work or personal. Work accounts belong to the organization and can be shared with other users. Personal accounts are purely personal to the user, like bank, PIN, or email passwords, which cannot be shared with other users. Accounts classified as personal will be visible only to the respective users. The super administrator cannot see the personal passwords of other users. If your organization does not want to allow personal password management, you can disable that. When you have a large number of passwords, properly classifying and organizing them becomes imperative. One of the efficient ways is to classify them into different types. You can either make use of the default account types or create new ones. Account types help you define specific fields you wish to have depending on the needs of your organization. In addition to storing passwords, you can also store documents, SSH keys, license files, images, and other sensitive digital identities, too. The provision to manage SSH keys help you store the keys securely, track their usage, rotate them periodically, and associate them with required Unix devices for authentication and remote access. For ease of identification and search, you can add tags and notes to the accounts. Once you add your accounts, they appear here in the inventory. Whenever you want to see the password of an account, you can click here. You can also copy the username and password to the clipboard. If you want to change the password stored here, you can click here and then take the help of our password generator, which helps generate strong passwords. If you choose this option, the password will be reset on the target device too. One of the important capabilities of SecureDen is automatically launching connections with remote computers and devices without disclosing the underlying passwords. You can allow users to launch a native or web-based RDP, SSH, SQL, and other connections in a single click. For every account, SecureDen displays security-related information such as account creation time, who created it, when it was last modified, and other details. You can share the account with any other user or user group with granular access permissions. When you share an account with view permissions, the user will be able to view the password. Modify permission grants the ability to change the password. Manage permission grants all management permissions over the account. When you give open connection permission, the user will not be able to see the password in plain text, but will be able to launch RDP, SSH, and other types of remote connections without seeing the password. SecureDen browser extensions autofill credentials on websites for direct login. You can configure just-in-time access by making use of the approval workflows. Whenever access is needed, the user will have to raise a request. Administrators will review the request and grant time-limited access. At the end of the usage period, the password can be automatically reset. All these actions follow a well-defined workflow. If you are managing Windows devices, during the discovery process, SecureDen fetches and displays the services, scheduled tasks, and IIS app pools that are making use of any particular domain account. In the case of services, their respective dependencies are also displayed. Whenever the password of a domain account is changed, SecureDen takes care of propagating the change across all dependencies. This way, you can always have complete visibility and control over service accounts and dependencies. You can view the historical information about password changes and the list of old passwords here. For every account, the report shows you the usage details about the account. It also tells you who all have access to this account. For easy access and navigation, filters are provided. Whenever you see icons like this, there is a filter. You can transfer the ownership of accounts to some other user whenever needed. SecureDen allows you to have access to your passwords even when you're outside of your network through the Secure Offline Access mechanism. If your organization does not need offline access, you can disable that feature.
Efficient password management requires robust organizing capabilities. You can organize your accounts as folders. You can create folders to reflect the hierarchical structure of the departments in your organization. Folders can have any number of subfolders. You can share an entire folder or a subfolder alone with a single user or a group of users. In the account section, the folder tree structure is displayed for quick navigation. Password management best practices mandate periodically resetting the passwords of IT assets. You can automate the remote password reset process at the folder level. Just define the periodicity here and SecureDen will automatically assign strong unique passwords for the accounts in accordance with your IT policy. All activities performed using the application are captured as audit trails. You get a complete record of who did what and when in the form of text-based trails. In addition, SecureDen records the entire remote privilege sessions initiated by users, which can be played back as a video. This gives you the recording of user activities on remote IT systems. You can also monitor sessions in parallel with full controls. You can collaborate and offer assistance or terminate if any malicious activity is found. You can generate various reports to assess the privileged access management scenario in your organization. In a single click, you can have a report of all the passwords accessed by a user. When someone leaves the organization, you can generate this report and reset the passwords accessed by that user. Just the opposite of this report is the account access report, which shows the list of users who have access to a particular account. Password compliance report makes an assessment of the passwords against the password policy of your organization and finds the violations. Password Security Analysis Report analyzes the passwords from the security standpoint and offers a strength score. If you're using the same password for multiple accounts or using dictionary words or weak passwords, it captures all such information and suggests remedial measures. As part of admin operations, you can define complexity rules for your passwords in the form of password policies. SecureDen's password generator helps generate passwords based on the policy defined. To have complete control and visibility over password access, you can configure notifications upon the occurrence of important events, such as password retrieval, account deletion, password change, share permission changes, and other activities. You can customize the product features as per the requirements of your organization, for example, you can choose whether to allow end users to add passwords to the application, allow offline access, and so on. The configurations are quite comprehensive and flexible. SecureDen provides a comprehensive set of APIs for application-to-application -application or application-to-database access. The normal practice in these scenarios is to hard-code the passwords in the calling applications or script files, Hard coding of passwords is a dangerous programming practice, and SecureDen helps eliminate hard coding through the APIs. Applications can use the APIs, get the required passwords from the database. SecureDen readily integrates with various enterprise applications. To gain holistic insights over access to critical systems, you can feed the trails related to password access to SIEM solutions in the form of syslog messages. The SIEM solutions can then correlate the data with other events and forewarn about the attacks that are waiting to happen. SecureDen integrates with corporate ticketing systems. The integration helps trace specific activities like password retrieval to corresponding entries in the ticketing system. You can enforce ticket validation for specific accounts. Once enabled, users will have to provide a valid ticket ID to retrieve or reset the password. If your organization uses smart cards for authenticating user logons, you can leverage the same for SecureDen authentication. When the users have logged into their machines using their smart cards, they will be allowed to access SecureDen web interface too. You can allow specific users to access the SecureDen interface over the internet. This is done by opening the SecureDen server port for restricted access over the internet. When doing so, you can enforce an additional layer of access security through the certificate-based client authentication. 
Secure Den Server will allow access to the web interface only if the browser presents the valid CA sign certificate or the key pair as configured. Since you're storing all your passwords in SecureDen, its availability becomes crucial. To ensure uninterrupted access, you can deploy multiple application servers as secondary. If the primary goes down, users can connect to any secondary application server and access data. If you're using MSSQL Server as the backend database, you can make use of MSSQL clustering too. Similarly, for disaster recovery purposes, you can take backup of the entire database and store it in a secure location. If something goes wrong with the installation, you can recover data from the backup in a few quick steps. In addition, super administrators can export data in the form of an encrypted HTML file as a backup copy. The encryption key is entered by the super administrator and it is not stored anywhere in the application. SecureDen offers a lot of other features. You may download the product directly from the website and contact support for any assistance. Thanks for your time and have a good day.